Two young boys rushed to the hospital after getting burned by fireworks. And authorities revealing that explosive they were playing with was homemade. Let's go to local 10 News reporter Janine Stanwood live in Miami, where those cousins are now recovering tonight. Janine. What a frightening situation for those little boys playing with a homemade firework known as an onion bomb. Right now, the two of them are right here at Jackson Memorial's burn unit getting specialized care. One by one, two little boys wheeled into Jackson Memorial's burn unit after firefighters say they were scorched with a homemade firework. Playing with fireworks um, with what's called an onion bomb. It's a homemade device. It's a powerful device. It happened in this fourplex in Pompano Beach off Northwest 6th Avenue. We are told the eight and nine year old cousins were leaning over the device on the ground trying to light it. Had they actually had it in their hands, this could have ended a lot worse. They were first taken to Broward Health, then transferred to JMH. Are the boys going to be okay? I got to meet ATF. Relatives at the hospital would only say the boys are fine. How are you guys doing? I'm sure this is a hard time for you but declined to say more as they were led inside the hospital with detectives. We also saw a state fire investigator who was photographing and testing material from the incident. That so-called onion bomb stayed on scene so experts could keep it for evidence. The nine-year-old was burned on the hand, the eight-year-old on his hands and face. Fireworks and children don't go together. Those little boys right now with second degree burns. We are told by authorities that their parents had no idea that they had been playing with that firework. The investigation continues. We're in Miami. I'm Janine Stanwood, Local 10 News. Fireworks and children don't go together. Okay, thanks a lot, Janine.